Hey, soul fam. Walk with me, talk with me. Oh my God, it's so beautiful out here. I feel so good. And I'm excited for this topic because I touched on it a little bit in my last video. And I wanted to just shed a little more, shed a little more light, right? So, fam, we can't ignore the physical world and be all in the spiritual world. Some of us, we talk about manifestations, and y'all know, I, I believe in prayer. I don't believe in manifestation. It's just not my practice, okay? So, I'm only going to speak on what I know. And what I do know is that we have to have strengths in the physical world and the spiritual world. We can't ignore the fact that we need physical things to survive, right? Right. So because of that, we have to be strong in both. So what this means is faith without works is dead so we have to learn how to maneuver in this physical world while using our spiritual abilities right so that's when we you, you see we'll pray right so we'll pray and then we have to wait for guidance we have to wait for guidance okay go here okay go there okay speak to that person qualifications get the qualifications that you need in the spirit in the physical world so that you can prevail right some of us we don't we don't think we need education anymore we think our education was a waste no you looked at it wrong some of us we need to think a little bigger you know, and stop thinking that everything in the physical world is there to destroy us. No, that is not a truth. And when you operate from that and you don't think that you need this physical world to survive, you will see yourself struggling in the long run. You're going to see yourself cut short. You're going to see yourself living in an uncomfortable space longer than you need to. longer than you need to so i'm gonna keep this short sweet cute get to the point find that balance it's getting dark so fam find that balance that you need in the spiritual world and the physical world and then you will see things start to fall in place so naturally. You will feel peace so naturally. You will feel so calm. You will feel so loved. You will feel so certain. You will have a certainty that can no one take away from you. And be patient. So fam, oftentimes we're rushing and we're, we're, we're rushing to the end. The only thing that comes at the end is death. Okay? So take your time and enjoy these steps. Enjoy these moments. Enjoy these relationships. Enjoy these lessons. Oftentimes, we're, we're rushing through and we're missing the lesson and we, we're missing it. And we're getting upset and then we're working from an angry place. Don't work from anger. Don't do it. Thank you for that light on that bike. All right, soul fam. Operate from that love that you have for yourself, that love that you have for others, and the love you, you have for those that may have hurt you. And find that balance and pick your pieces up and get it moving. Get it moving, get it grooving, okay? There's no darkness without light and there's no light without darkness. Love you so, fam. I'll see you soon. Amelia, it's here. <laughs> I'll see you soon.